Have you ever looked at the stars and wondered why ancient thinkers believed the Earth was the center of everything? Throughout history, humans gazed at the sky, formulating models to explain celestial movements and the universe's structure. In this video, we'll explore why Earth was once considered the universe's center by ancient philosophers and astronomers. We'll examine the ideas of Aristotle and Ptolemy, who shaped geocentric models, and how Copernicus, Kepler, and Galileo challenged them. Finally, we'll reflect on how challenging old ideas and embracing evidence transform science, shaping modern physics and astronomy. Let's start in ancient Greece with Aristotle, 384 to 322 BCE, a student of Plato and tutor to Alexander the Great. Aristotle contributed significantly to many fields, including astronomy, profoundly shaping early scientific thought and philosophy. He proposed that the universe was composed of four elements, earth, water, air, and fire, each with a natural place. Each element sought its natural position, explaining why rocks fall downward and flames rise upward in Aristotle's framework. Aristotle believed in a geocentric model where Earth was stationary at the center of the universe, unmoving. He thought the sun, moon, planets, and stars revolved around Earth in perfect circles, reflecting heavenly perfection. The circle was considered the most perfect shape. Therefore, celestial bodies moved in circular paths around Earth. Aristotle's ideas weren't based on experiments, but philosophical reasoning, reflecting how early science relied on observation and intuition. This geocentric model shaped early astronomy and influenced scientific thought and philosophy for many centuries thereafter. What do you think influenced Aristotle's framework, and how might his ideas have shaped debates about natural phenomena? Aristotle's ideas, though not experimentally verified, profoundly shaped the way humans perceived their place in the cosmos for centuries. They provided the foundation for further developments in astronomy, inspiring thinkers like Ptolemy to expand on his framework. 